Hey everyone, it's your girl Sky, and as you can see by the title, we're here to talk about tummy tucks and BBLs. I recently decided to start um, videoing my journey to Tijuana, Mexico with my doctor, Dr. Bayez. And another reason, well, the main reason why I decided to um, video this journey is because when I went on YouTube to look at you know, research and find people that been to him. I really didn't see too many. And I know he have did a lot of people. So the ones I did see, they wasn't really about nothing. So I was like, why not? Why not help the dolls out there that wants to go to Dr. Bayez? And it's nothing really out there for them to see. So today it's May the 30th, 2021. And my surgery is on June the 7th, 2021. That is six days away so it's right around the corner um basically what i'll be talking about is a little bit of things that i'm bringing because i am going to a recovery house which the recovery house that i'm going to is going to be doll house recovery which i will also blog that so stay tuned for that but the things that i am bringing are just simple things because they're offering me um, supplies for an extra $40. They do supply you with the supplies that you need. The only supplies they don't supply you with is like a backboard, which I got that. Um, an app board, which I got that and it has not came in yet. Um, they don't supply you with your Fajas. Um, I don't know if y'all doctor um, provide y'all with Fajas. Um, I got my Faha from like a local place here in Houston, Texas, um, which this is a real compression Faha, y'all. Don't let people tell y'all the stage two Fajas is a stage one Faha. A stage one Faha, it's low compression, you know, so you can be able to be, you know, mobile and not stiff and for the girls that's having BBLs, so your booty won't be you know too tight um it will usually look like this and zip something that isn't really you know this the ones that click 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 those are stage two fives y'all and i also got like compression socks i know y'all can see i put my name on here y'all i'm going to recovery house i don't know how people are i'm the only child so i just do petty stuff like this <laughs> I got my compression socks. I paid $30 for three pairs. On Actually, I'm lying. That's what they was going to charge me if I would have bought them from the recovery house. I paid $8 for three pair. And these are some good, strong, you know, socks. Um, I did buy me a BBL pillow. I feel like this is the brand I went with off of Amazon. It was like 40 something dollars. I really feel like I don't have to show y'all how this looks because I know y'all know, but you know, this is what it is. I will tell y'all if it's good or not. Um, I brought some, I'm bringing some briefs, some black ones because you know, we're gonna have a lot of blood going around and you know, black won't make you feel less gross if they was a light color. Oh, I got this little thing. It's you know, the little thing to hold your dreams. I was told this was a good thing to have. It's good for when you're in the shower. And I didn't even open it. It's my first time opening it. But it's, it wraps around your waist. And then it has two little things to hold your dreams. I think that's cute and unique. And I got the little pea thing. This is also a brand that I found on um, Amazon. And y'all, on the videos that people made, peeing with these or how they use these, them things look small. I don't know if it looks small right now, but this thing is huge. It's literally like the size of my hand, y'all. But I guess that's good because that means it can catch all the pee. And it got another little extra part to make it longer. That way you don't have to be directly over the toilet and i brought 
of course i bring like nightgowns like long ones i couldn't find too many that have buttons i was told that would be a good thing but they're loose they're big and they can lift them and do whatever they need but i feel like this is going to be my go-to one because it is a zipper and it is like kind of like a towel but like a comfortable towel feeling and i think this will be my go-to and what else of course my toothbrush um and toothpaste because they don't provide you with um hygiene so if you need shampoo and stuff like that and lotion you can bring that everything else they got you the gauze the the p mats or whatever you need they got it 40 dollars extras and their um rooms are i think it was like 190 for your own room and 140 for a shared room i decided to go with a shared room because i don't need my own space save me a little coin and um that's pretty much it my waist is a 28 my hips is a 33 um i i i always thought i was a bigger person but i'm not i'm really petite but I do have the stomach that like fold, like go over, you know? So that is the reason why I'm getting a tummy tuck. And I do have a little butt, but I mean, if I can make it better, why not? So that is the reason why, but mainly it was for my tummy tuck and you know, the butt, it, it could be improved. So that's why I'm having a bit on um, BBL. I'm not gonna tell anyone, oh, don't have surgery because of what society tells you baby if you want to feel good about yourself have the surgery you have one have been something that you have wanting to be done forever or something that you feel like you need to level up on these hoes because of what everybody else leveling up like if that's what you choose do it just be happy with yourself if it makes you feel better feel better like this is a crucial ass fucking world and society makes us feel shitty about ourselves so if that's what is pushing you to get a better body get it and if you want to do it because you have kids and you want to improve your body and this is something you really want then also do it like i'm not against anything so on that note girls if y'all are interested in getting a tummy tuck and a bbl from dr bayaz in mexico tijuana I am the girl to give you the tea. Like I said, my surgery is in six days, so I am going to do my best to inform y'all with all the information that I can give y'all and my whole experience with him. I see y'all girls later. Peace.